essentially the government is talking about zoning the oceans? That's correct. Uh, that's exactly correct. And Congress talked about this for eight years in the past, not in this Congress, but in prior Congresses. And Congress elected to do nothing. But now the president, by an executive order, has decided that he's going to do this. And you've got dozens of agencies participating in this process and spending taxpayer mm -hmm. dollars that haven't been appropriated. And the process has not been authorized. And, and what's your greatest fear in this? What do you think the aim of the White House is? Well, essentially what you could do, if you look at the, the breadth of the ruling, it says that it wants to control activities in the oceans and all the sources thereof, which means that you could theoretically have a raindrop fall on my neighbor's house in uh, Bryan, Texas, and what that raindrop is going to flow into the ocean, and because of that, they could regulate the activities of what my neighbor could do at their house. Congressman, are you worried that this, this is just a, a bare-faced power grab by the White House? Uh, absolutely. They're trying to find a way to uh, determine what activities can and cannot happen on the ocean and then also take that into the Great Lakes and also virtually to every square inch of property in the United mm -hmm. States. Here's, uh, here's the White House uh, about this very thing and your concern. They say this, the national ocean policy is structured around nine priority objectives to improve stewardships of the ocean. It in no way restricts any ocean, coastal or Great Lake activity. What do you think? What do you say? Well, the problem is, is if you look at the language of the agencies, there are dozens of agencies involved in this process. And each of the agencies has put out a report as to how they're going to help be a part of it. And each of them have said it's similar to taking the zoning that occurs in a city or a town mm -hmm. and extending it to the ocean. Now, think about what your, your local right. town uh, council yeah. can do to you. They're, they're essentially trying to do that from here in Washington with unelected, unaccountable, and now with the GSA activities, irresponsible bureaucrats. Uh, Cesar. All right. Uh, Bill Flores, Republican congressman from Texas. Sir, thank you very much.